Ciao guys, welcome back to my channel. I've just landed in the beautiful island of Gran Canaria, which is part of the Canary Islands, very close to Morocco. I came here to work remotely on probably the most important and challenging project of my data career so far, but I will tell you more about this in just a few minutes. Since you like a lot of the other videos that I made while I was working remotely from Thailand, I decided to show you how I'm spending a day from here in Gran Canaria. And so let's start by showing you my house for the next week or so. So basically I found this very nice place on Airbnb which is in the northern part of the island, very close to the beach and city center. And this is how it looks like from the inside. When you enter you have this very cool patio with loads of plants and nice decor. Then if I enter inside there is a cozy living room with a big table and sofa to relax. Here's the kitchen with pretty much everything I need for cooking. Then we have a pretty nice bathroom as well and finally a cool bedroom too. But the part that I probably prefer as I will spend most of my time here is this elevated little room with another table which I will be using as an office for my work. And for all of this I'm paying 55 euros per night which should be around $60. This is definitely a bit more expensive than the average prices that you see here on the island. However, I really needed a space full of comforts as I'm here to do some deep work. starting my morning with some fruit and a workout that I will be doing using this outdoor gym equipment and machines that I found near the house in a park. As I don't have a fixed schedule, I will just do a variety of body weight exercises, so let's get into it. is done I'm going back home for a quick shower and then I will have my breakfast which I partially prepared the night before which consists of overnight oat with almond milk and chia seeds as well as some nuts and some fruits and this will also be the time I open my laptop and do some admin tasks and these are things like checking my emails and also my social medias pages and answering everything that is required from me that can be queries related to brand deals for the YouTube channel or questions that I got overnight from my mentees or even comments and messages that I I got on Instagram or LinkedIn. After my breakfast is done, I'll head to a cafe in the city center from where I will do some work. The good thing about Gran Canaria and the rest of the Canary Islands like Tenerife and Lanzarote is that they are well known by digital nomads. And this is why there are plenty of cafes where you are allowed to use your laptop and they just have the perfect setup for you to do some work. The menu of this place looks actually pretty good. So I'm also gonna have lunch here and I've just ordered the famous Spanish croquetas and also a Caesar salad. Now after lunch it's time for a little siesta from the beach so just a bit of a chill time to fully enjoy the beauty of this island. I really like this place mainly for two reasons and the first has to be the weather. As you guys know I live in London and we don't have the best weather throughout the year and so with a four hours flight here you can enjoy a tropical weather and very high temperatures even now in mid-December. And also this place is great because everything is in walking distance and so you can find rooms, cafes, restaurants, the beach and co -working working spaces all very close to each other. And speaking of co-working spaces, now for my afternoon, I bought a daily pass in this co-working space that is called Talleres Palermo, which is perfect to do some deep work. This is one of the most popular co-working spaces on the island. I must say I've seen better co-working spaces, but these are still everything that I need. And so a screen, good Wi-Fi and drinks, and also a nice terrace for breaks. <laughs> And so now I can finally give you the big announcement and tell you all the details about what I'm working on. So basically, I've decided to finally build my own data analytics course. I started working on it many months ago, and obviously because I have a full-time job, I'm working on it mainly during my evenings. Now, I had around seven days of holidays left from work that I had to use before the end of the year. And so I decided to travel to a more secluded place and spend all these days to focus solely on the course. And just to give you some context, as I start posting content on different social medias like YouTube, Instagram and LinkedIn, I'm producing a lot of learning content for uh, data analytics. And since I received so many messages from you asking, I decided to package it all together and build a data analytics master course. Apart from following your request, I decided to build this course also because I took more than 20 data courses myself and loads of other material in the past years. And I see that a lot of courses are just too theoretical or maybe just focused on one specific aspect without covering all data analytics 
analytics topics as a whole. And this is why I'm building what I hope will be the best data analytics course out there, where I will teach you how to use Excel, SQL, Tableau, and Python, first covering the learning side of it, and then the doing with a real world project for each of the tools we cover. And I will be also covering AI, which again is an aspect that most of data analytics courses do not consider as they are outdated. And by the end of the course, we will bring together all the projects and build a personal portfolio website that can be shared with recruiters. There are many other juicy things that I will bring in the course, like having a data analytics recruiter, giving a clear understanding of what he is looking for in candidates and some nice tips to land interviews. But I will leave all the details in the video description. So if you're interested, make sure to check it out. Today in the co-working space, I just finalized one of the projects that we will be doing together. And I must say it's by far one of the most amazing projects that I have ever worked on. So I cannot wait to show it to you inside the course. And well, time for dinner now. So I'm getting some seafood in a little restaurant that I found in the island and some sangria as well, because I just love it. And then I'm going back home to do a little more work and planning tomorrow's day before crashing to bed. And well, I hope you enjoyed the video and found it inspiring. Make sure to check the link in the description if you want to know more about the course and leave a comment if you have any questions. And well, enjoy the rest of your day. Ciao for now and see you in the next one.